Hello and welcome to a day in my life. So I got a co-working space at WeWork. If you guys don't know, it's a space that has a ton of big offices for really big companies. It also has small one-off offices and then it has a ton of common area space for people that get the regular membership where you can just come and be part of the office and have not a dedicated office itself, but a dedicated space here, you know, throughout the whole space. They have like three floors here at this one, which is awesome. And I chose this one specifically because the environment, the vibes that is so LA to say but seriously the environment like the energy here is really good it's all open very bright right now I'm actually in a phone booth so it's a little dark in here probably it's like a little one person phone booth and you can come in here to take calls I was just taking a call for first form and you know do like something where you want to have a little more privacy where you also don't want to bother others like in the common area they also have free like coffee and tea and whatnot and I promise this is not like a sponsored thing at all though if we work does that sponsor your girl because this stuff is not cheap <laughs> to be a member but it's so worth it you guys environment is huge and who you surround yourself with is so important and I was doing all of my work generally at home sometimes in a coffee shop where there might or might not be a plug there may be really annoying music uh, not everyone is there to work so it just wasn't the best work environment for me so now I've created the best work environment for myself literally productivity has gone up happiness is up through the roof I've already met so many people one of my big goals this year is to expand upon my LA network just be that person that is highly connected in the area that they live. I think that's so important. You never know what opportunities or friendship or relationships can come out of just kind of putting yourself out there and meeting new people. So that's what I'm doing and I'm making it just such a focus of mine this year. And I've already met some amazing people here. And the people here are total badasses. Like they're all different entrepreneurs. There's different companies here like Pinterest. It's just a really cool place to be a part of and everyone here is working really hard so it really just rubs off on each other. I got here at about 7 a.m. and it is about to be 12 so I'm gonna go ahead and leave right now and head to the gym today we are training back right now with my work schedule the way that I have to do my training and my work is the last appointment that my trainer can take is at 1 p.m. so what I do is I come and do a session from about 7 a.m. to 12 and then I get ready around 12 and leave go to the gym from 1 until about 2 30 I make it home by 3 I walk Vinny about a mile and a half I play with him I feed him I love on him and then I come back here for a a second session of work session for the day and I leave by about 8 p.m. I go home I try to do a few things really quickly and get in bed as soon as I can and then I'm sleeping by 10 p.m. every night and I wake up at 5 30 so jam-packed days but it, I'm in a push season in my work life in every single area of my life actually right now so this is like such a push season for me and it's good but on the weekends I definitely make sure to rest because I really need that rest and need extra sleep I need time to not be so on it you know what I mean you know throughout the week I'm just I have to be on it at all times so I need that time on the weekend to relax so hopefully that gives you a little insight to my day-to-day -day, what my life is looking like right now and just how important environment is so that is it I'm gonna go crush a workout and I hope you guys enjoy the back workout this is what the little phone booth looks like and I'm pretty sure this looks really shady because I ran out of Ziploc bags, so I, I used tin foil to wrap up my vitamins. <laughs> I have like a digestive enzyme, I have probiotic, I have a multivitamin, and I think Harmony is in there as well. I hope. <laughs> we'll see.
I took Vinny for a nice walk, which is part of our daily routine. Came back, showered, got ready again, and now Vinny and I are headed back to the office to finish out our day of work. Not gonna lie, I'm tired and just like making myself go through the motions just to get to the office. So I know as soon as I get there that I'll have some good productive work hours. It's one of the times I'm just like, I'm wiped. Days of back to back nonstop like this is it's a lot, but that's why I'm shooting for that weekend so I can have a little rest this weekend to really just rest because I didn't get enough rest this last weekend. And when you don't do that on the weekend, it doesn't put yourself in the best spot to start the week. So yeah, I'm huge on taking some rest on the weekend, which is coming. Don't worry. I'm like not convincing you guys. I'm trying to convince myself. It's fine. <laughs> you look grumpy. Would you like to come to work with mommy? Do you want to say hi to all my friends at work? And you have friends waiting for you at work too. Did you know that? They said, where's Vinny? Can you bring him? I said, yes. Hello guys. It is actually the next morning. It's about 6.30 in the morning. I don't train with Doug today. It's our one off day. We train together four days a week. So um, today I'm training by myself. So I'm training this morning because I have an appointment later. So I had to like move my schedule around. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, then you already know what that appointment was, I think by now, probably. It's uh, quite the big appointment. Very excited, very, not, not too nervous. I have a lot of trust, but just, yeah. Anyways, I need to get my workout in now and then go grocery shopping for some food and then get to work before I have that later. So. Let's go crush it. Also, side note, I have not seen my boyfriend in what feels like forever. We spent the holidays together, and then after the holidays, we were like, you know, spending time at each other's places, and then like work and, you know, prep and his program and everything really kicked into high gear. And now we're both going like from 5 a.m. until like 9 when we're getting in bed, and then we FaceTime each other. We're like, hi, how's your life? <laughs> but yesterday, I texted him, I was like, who am I? What is my life? What's my family like? Do I have a boyfriend? He was like, you better know the answer to that last question. Yeah, it's just been, it's been busy around here, but great. And we both like, it's such positive things in our lives that we're both like, just we're grinding, you know. Part of me definitely wishes that we could like grind together at the same time, but we just, you know, we only live 12 minutes away, but yeah, I'm, I don't know why I'm complaining to you about that. Oh, the reason I'm bringing it up is because he might be here he should be, he better be. <laughs> it's his workout time, so hopefully we'll see him. back home from the workout we had such a great lift we ended up lifting together totally unplanned but you guys know it was low-key planned on my end i was like be there at the same time if we're training the same muscle we're definitely training together it was a great session we're still in love check <laughs> I'm being ridiculous, I know, but I just got home and because I went to the gym first thing, I'm doing my morning routine now. And part of my morning routine is reading a devotional every single morning. So I always read this devotional. I've read it for honestly years now and it does not get old. Like it still is so good. So I wanted to share with you guys today's devotional cause it's so freaking good. And it like completely aligns with everything that I talk about, but also aligns with my goals and the fact that this channel's about taking you guys on the journey that I'm on and like what's actually in the journey, right? It's not really about the 
the end goal. It's about the journey there. And this like gives advice directly to that. So I want to share it with you because I know a lot of you are chasing your own goals and I think it'll give you a lot of like hope and peace and just happiness as you go throughout your journey. So I'm going to sit down real quick. Say, let's sit down. Oh, you're so cute. Say, Vinny gets all the likes. Please thumbs up this video. I should be able to see my face. Feel my face when I'm with you. So it has a little blurb for each day. I've shared this before, but this one is so good. You guys, you're gonna love it. I am with you and for you. When you decide on a course of action that is in line with my will, nothing in heaven or earth can stop you. You may encounter many obstacles as you move forward with your goal, but don't be discouraged. Never give up. With my help, you can overcome any obstacle. Do not expect an easy path as you journey hand in hand with me, but do remember that I am your very present helper. I am with you always. Much, much stress results from your wanting to make things happen before their time has come. One of the main ways I assert my sovereignty is in the timing of events. If you want to stay close to me and do things my way, ask me to show you the path forward moment by moment. Instead of dashing ahead towards your goal, let me set the pace. Slow down, enjoy the journey in my presence. Wow, that is like touching every part of my soul right now because I feel like that's everything that I need to hear. Hopefully it's what you guys need to hear. And I just think back on different things in my life where even, you know, chasing my pro card, I always use that as an example, but there's a reason why it happened when it happened. You know, I'm going to this appointment today and it was gonna happen sooner and then it didn't and I was a little disappointed. And like, so to hear that today, it just kind of reminded me that like there's a time for everything. And the fact that, you know, this is even going on is one of the things I've prayed for before and I really wanted and it's just it's kind of all making sense to me right now and that things really do have an order and a pace and that there's nothing we can do to make it happen sooner but also when it's in alignment with where you're meant to go in life where God has you going in life when that's in alignment nothing on heaven or earth can stop you from getting it it's just a matter of time of when it'll happen not if so that gives me such like peace and contentment and happiness and thankfulness I'm just like over pouring with gratitude right now because I have lived this in my life and I'm living it in my life right now. So it's great and I wanted to share that with you. I always want to try to end the uh, vlogs on a good note in some way. Maybe like a, maybe I'll do that from now on. Maybe like a positive quote or like something I heard recently or a podcast, maybe a devotional. Someone mentioned in the comment section on the last video, they were like, hey, could you try to end a video with a sunset here and there? Maybe like once a month. And I was like, that is such a good idea, you guys. Sunsets are my favorite things in the world and I've been making more of a point to try to go to more at least on the weekends my days during the week are absolutely insane right now like just packed from wake up to sleep which is awesome and I love it but I'm not getting too many uh, sunsets during the week so I love those ideas keep sharing those ideas with me and I love your feedback your comments like help me to create better content for you guys and just keep coming back videos every single Wednesday don't forget if you're not subscribed go ahead and press that subscribe button right now leave a comment below what was your favorite part of the video or what do you really enjoy when you guys tell me that it's not just for my ego but it's like feedback back for me so I can say oh I had no idea that they would enjoy me showing that I just happened to show it but now that I know that they enjoy it I will show more of it so that's what that means it just gives me feedback and of course I love any love that you guys want to share so hugs I love you have a great day and I'll see you in next Wednesday's video bye <laughs>